Welcome to the University of Finley Art and Culture Show. I am your host, Sharenda, and we are excited to welcome to our set today, Mr. Ronnie Rodriguez. Welcome. Hi, thank you, Sharenda. It's so nice to have you here. Yeah, good. And you are a look-alike artist for Johnny Depp. And right now we have you half Johnny, half Jack. Right. Uh, kind of half and half at the moment. Uh, we'll be doing the other show later on, so uh -huh. I'm going to jump right into Jack Sparrow. So uh -huh. see how that goes. Yeah. yeah. And there are many lookalikes, many tribute artists out there, but you are known as the best for Johnny. And I think that that is awesome. Uh, I know you have been on the front of Thanks. People magazine with Johnny. <laughs> where they have your picture and his picture in, in character of something that he's currently in the movies doing and they're asking which one's Johnny that's a huge compliment when you have paid that close attention to an artist and the characters that they're doing to be able to represent them yeah it's actually been it, it's kind of one of those things where it's just been an amazing uh, kind of journey but uh, yeah, you're right. We were on a, a cover of a magazine that Johnny actually asked for. He wanted to see it himself. And uh, we, were on the, we were on the Black Pearl and it went around. It was kind of funny. It was a magazine that uh, they had everything wrong. Ages, where we were, uh, everything, you know, including me on the, on the uh, main picture. And um, anyway, Johnny wanted to see it. If and people would catch it and yeah, stuff. Yeah, it was mm -hmm. pretty funny though. It, it made its rounds all the way through the Black Pearl and all the pirates. And you know, by the time I got it, it was a wrinkled up little piece of paper. And uh, yeah, it was pretty funny. But uh, yeah, I've been in actually several magazines now with, mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. you know, uh, comparisons, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. it's kind of funny. But. Well, and you've been in many of his movies. It, you know, people think <laughs> that Captain Jack's the one that you're asked to do probably the most often in character for different yeah. uh, events, private and corporate. Yeah. But you've also been in 21 Jump Street. You've been in, oh, what's the one where there's a computer and they're trying to figure everything out? Because you actually are speaking as Johnny. Yeah, they, uh, that was with uh, Nathan for You. And it was a TV show, and I actually saved the planet. You know, that's kind of a, there's an asteroid coming, and I have to, I'm playing a hacker, so I uh, quick do, do some quick uh, keyboard strokes. Next thing you know, I saved the planet, so that was pretty good. Yeah. But I often get that, you know, we want a Johnny-looking guy. Since they can't get Johnny, they, you know, I'm the next best they thing, have you. I guess. And, yeah. and that's happened in some award shows, too, where they'll have you show up <laughs> backstage representing Johnny, and you're with the mm -hmm. real artists that people know. Right. It's it's, the spoofs. Uh, yeah, it's been pretty funny. I mean, this journey is just, it's amazing. I, I don't know what else to say other than it's amazing because uh, the doors that were opened, I always wanted to get in the movies. Mm -hmm. And uh, after raising a family, my wife and I, um, you get to, I got to the point where I thought, well, that's probably a pipe dream. And then lo and behold, Pirates came out. And next thing I know, I'm on the Black Pearl and uh, um, my wife, Jules, helped me uh, get a costume together. Actually, truth be known, she put the costume together. And... Uh, yeah, it was uh, just an amazing uh, journey. Yeah. yeah, and there was a Western-ish movie oh. that he did, and they hired you as a double for him. Yeah. But then they yeah. knew you had talent, so they hired you back <laughs> as yourself as an actor in the movie. They, um, How many times has that happened, <laughs> yeah, that folks? Was, I mean, that's a huge yeah, compliment that to was, your uh, talents. That was Lone Ranger. And, okay. Uh, that was actually pretty funny because uh, they kept me on the hook for a long time to be double for Johnny as Tonto. And uh, yeah, through one thing after another, it, it, uh, they went from, I think it was New Mexico, Utah, Colorado and then when we got to LA I ended up just being me and I actually got a stunt credit out of that because they blew up a train you, you might see me I'm the one that gets blown up no. <laughs> <laughs> and class everywhere and yeah it was it was uh, I got to meet Channing Tatum uh, I, I'm sorry that was uh, 21 Jump Street yeah um, I was gonna say that, that 21 was, Jump Street you had some yeah. Hollywood <laughs> time with Channing Tatum yeah, yeah actually that was a that was kind of an amazing story because I met with uh, the, the um, producers and uh, they had um, they want to know if I could pull off being Johnny mm -hmm. in, the, in the film because they, they couldn't get Johnny. He, mm -hmm. he was going to do a cameo, but they only had him for like one day. So it means he had to fly in, get in costume, do a scene, and, and, get and then out. gone. Yeah. So I uh, had to cover it for three weeks. I ran around looking like a guy from ZZ Top, and, and uh, that was pretty funny. And uh, I, don't know, I got a stunt credit out of that one, too, because I had to ride a motorcycle. <laughs> 
a man so, of many talents. Oh, that was funny. That was a that was a great one though because uh, while I was on set, they had me with this rubber nose, and I was going to save the rubber nose uh, and then give it to Johnny on the next movie. Uh huh. And uh, they wouldn't let me keep it. I kept thinking, I'm going to wad that thing up, stuff it in my pocket. <laughs> next time I see him, I'm, this belongs to you. <laughs> but, well, uh, and you you are such a humble individual. <laughs> we do want to let the audience know you do know Johnny. Johnny knows who you are. If you walk in a room, you know one another. It's kind of hard. To, the first time we met was uh, on Black Pearl, and he was dressed up as Jack Sparrow. I was dressed as Jack Sparrow. And uh, we kind of kind of passed each other. And uh, in doing so, we both kind of just looked at each other, like, you know, <laughs> made our, did our passing. Yeah. And he was going off to do an interview, actually, with uh, Disney. And I was going to the Black Pearl. So if, it was about three weeks later that we actually met, uh, like, for the first time. Uh -huh. But uh, that was, uh, that was uh, amazing. So now I've done about seven movies with him. Mm -hmm. And uh, the last one we did was uh, up in uh, Vancouver called The Professor and uh, spent uh, yeah about a month up there with them and that was that was uh, amazing that yeah. was a good time well so. and you are an artist in other ways too and that's what's mm. fun <laughs> when we have the opportunity and the honor to interview artists uh, that are whether they're tribute artists or they're vocalists or musicians or motivational mm. speakers it, there's so many talents that come with it the individuals that we have the honor to interview and for you you actually are a u.s veteran through the navy yes, thank you I for am. your service oh, you're welcome. Thank you. and jules whom i also have the honor of knowing is an amazing artist in her own right uh, she also is a u.s veteran with the navy she correct yes. and she yeah. was the first female captain pilot for the navy correct first female f-18 uh plane captain there you go and that was uh yeah that was amazing because at that time that was uh, like a brand new airplane yeah and uh yeah but she's amazing they, yeah uh, yeah she you guys are a powerhouse oh, individually thank you. Thank you. and together you're just yeah. a power team wow. so with the navy after you finished touring with them as an active duty, you had the opportunity to go back and work with them as a civilian, and you are still working with the Navy, correct? I am, yes. Yeah. So you're a federal employee. Federal employee. And it's so cool. How many people get the opportunity to say, I worked for the Navy and or served in the Navy and am now working for the Navy as a professional photographer. As a professional photographer. So many of the <laughs> AP photos we see coming out in the news are your work. Some of them, yeah, you, you'll be surprised, but if you look at the little byline, uh -huh. you'll, you'll recognize my name. It says, courtesy of US uh, Navy. <laughs> That's from, yeah. Not, That's it's you. not always me, but yeah. <laughs> That's hilarious. And, uh, but uh, yeah, we've, I've, I've, I can't even believe it myself sometimes, uh, talking to different people, the career path that I chose. Uh -huh. um, I've been able to do like two things that I love best. One is photography and the other is being an actor. I ended up, and I, I've done my it. own TV show things. Uh, people have hired me just to be me, but uh -huh. um, it's amazing that I was able to get into this. Um, and, the, and the credit goes to, first off, Jules, because she's the one that dressed me up to begin with. She saw something, we were in the, in the theater watching the first pirate movie. She's and like, we, you got this, Yeah, babe. and she says, she just gives me the elbow and says, you look just like him. So throughout the rest of the movie, she's saying, uh, you know, you, you look just like this. him. You, you look need, just like yeah. him. And um, I thought she was making fun of me because we had to wear the guy liner. Uh -huh, you know? <laughs> uh -huh. So uh, anyhow, yeah, she got the costume all ready and everything. So that, that put me on that path. So I really got to thank her for that. And then... Uh, Oh, yeah, she's always the business side. She's always behind the scenes. Mm -hmm. So uh, were times where I should have been probably on the, um, I don't know, on the forefront of, of getting into an audition or something. Jules has been right there. Right there. So she's got me into a lot of, uh, you know, a lot of great positions uh, to, to do what I do. And, and uh, again, doing the photography and acting. Mm -hmm. And then, uh, yeah, it's just been an amazing uh, uh, journey. And I'm so glad it's been your journey because it's been a gift for individuals who will never have the opportunity to meet the characters that Johnny portrays yeah. or Johnny himself. Yeah. But uh, you, with what you do, you are able to do corporate events, school events, community events, nonprofit events, yeah. where they tell you which Johnny to show up and you're able <laughs> yeah. to show up and, and yeah. just give them a stellar performance. Oh, thank you. Thank you. It's uh, that in itself is just, uh, I think on the top of my list is, is uh, you know, working with the kids because uh -huh. to see them light up when they see Jack Sparrow. Yeah. That's, that's fun. Feels good. That's fun. Yeah. We, uh, I remember we did a gig in uh, LAX, and we were working with a bunch of, uh, um, uh, what do you call them, uh, uh, 
uh, the dogs that kind of keep you, uh, calm you down. Kind and, of the uh, therapy dogs? Therapy dogs. Okay. Were, thank you. And uh, the kids, I don't know who was more um, uh, energized through all that, myself, the kids, or the dogs. <laughs> you were all <laughs> we all had a great each time. other's positive we energy. We took photos with dogs and with kids. And I mean, people coming off airplanes and, you know, next thing you know, you're with dogs. It was great. That was a good one. And they were like, there's uh, Captain Jack. Yeah, right there in the middle of the uh, airport. That was uh uh, they had to keep us moving though because mm -hmm. it did actually create a little bit of a stir sure, and sure. Uh, but then working with different charity groups um, you know that's another one that uh, is amazing or one group we worked with uh, uh, a young man who was uh, kind of mentally challenged mm -hmm. and um, I did it in, like two years in a row and uh, he actually came back the second year I came back, he ran up to me and he's like, Johnny, just Aww. gives me this great big hug, you know, and, and uh, yeah, it was that, that was one of those things that almost brings like tears yeah. to your eyes because of the, um, the emotion, uh -huh. you know, uh -huh. but the fact that he remembered and, uh, and, he looked forward and oh to yeah, it. he yeah. was just, that was, that was great. But, awesome. Um, and then, yeah, we've even done uh, children's hospital things, go through, dressed up as pirates and mm -hmm. oh, that's amazing too. That's another, because uh, uh, Johnny does that. That's one mm -hmm. of the things he likes to do. And yeah. I didn't know that. I just yeah. knew that Johnny gets in trouble for beating up people and throwing <laughs> things in the, the rentals that they are in. <laughs> you know. So I, unfortunately, that doesn't make the news. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, he's actually a really good guy. And um, as far as uh, you know, the news, sometimes uh, I, I think it's um, you, you can't really believe everything you read kind of a thing. Sure. But uh, uh, my experience with him, he's always been great. And and. Um, I would think that if I had somebody on set and they looked like me, it would be a little bit awkward. Mm -hmm. And he seems to have been really good with it. Takes with, it with it. a grain of salt. Yeah. yeah. We did uh, uh, with the, it was called with Adam Sandler. We did uh, Jack and Jill, and uh, yeah. they had asked. They said, uh, "Oh, Johnny, I'd asked you who's my double." And I guess one of the persons, uh, AP, uh, assistants, uh, said, uh, "Oh, it's Ronnie." He says, "Fine, I'm out of here." <laughs> and he kind of packed up and left. <laughs> so they just kind of gave me clothes and said, "Get dressed." I ended up working with Al Pacino, wow. who thought I was still Johnny, and he was in midstream in a conversation. So he leans over and he starts finishing this conversation with me, and I'm trying to go, uh, how, "How do, do I, I tell him I'm not Johnny yeah. anymore?" And the cameraman's behind the camera, and he's just cracking up. And yeah, finally we got it. You know, uh, uh, Al Pacino kind of looks over and goes, "Who are you?" <laughs> <laughs> I said, "I'm Ronnie." Johnny left. <laughs> He just was like, that's good. That's, yeah. Well, and it's so funny that you're Ronnie, he's Johnny. I mean, you can't yeah. get much oh. closer to Even that. when we were, when we first started with Pirates, we'd be on the ship and they'd be, uh, they'd say like, uh, you know, uh, Ronnie to the, to the helm. And sometimes Johnny go, is that, you know, yeah. and the people would be, I didn't know that Johnny had a brother named Ronnie. Oh <laughs> my gosh. Are you Johnny's brother? It's like, oh no, I'm, you know, but, uh, um, matter of fact, one of the, uh, cameramen, um, very well known. I won't mention any names, but um, he kept calling me Johnny. He would say Johnny. I asked him. I said, "Try not to call me Johnny." Yeah, it was by yeah. accident. And uh, try not to call me Johnny because I didn't want them to think that I was trying, you know, trying to, to overstep. To, yeah, sure. And uh, so he said, "Okay, yeah, thanks, thanks." You know, and uh, two minutes after I said it, you know, Johnny, can I get you to stand back over here? <laughs> <laughs> so that was that oh, was uh, that's funny. pointless. <laughs> so for um, what you do within the trade, you also have had the honor of being recognized by your professional peers it, through the real awards and at Sunburst yeah. uh, International uh, Lookalike conferences. So what? And, and I think you're in Hall of Fame. Correct. Um, you know, I, I I don't think I'm in Hall of Fame. Okay, then you're really really close. I I've, yeah, I've actually won a few awards there, and uh, I got to thank uh, Greg Thompson and and then Jana Joes. Um, they're you know, the ones. Yeah, on the, they're the, the owners of the conferences. And um, one's in Vegas, one's in Orlando. So yeah. that's fun. And uh, they've been great because without them, I don't think I'd be here either. Uh, you know, the, the, their help is what you know gets you there, and. Um, by, but I remember going to a class that Greg was putting on, and one of the things they said was how to hug people while you're taking photos. Oh yeah, just that's simple, so simple little important. things, and it is important, especially you know nowadays, and you know, and um, but um, that was great. So without them, that it'd be tough. But I think I got best actor a couple mm -hmm. of times, um, and mm -hmm. uh, best look alike, like the closest <laughs> to reality look alike yeah. of the actor. Yeah, yeah. That, I, get, I did yeah. get that. Um, yeah, that, it kind of spans from like 2006 to. I think the last one I was at was 2000, 2016, I believe. Uh -huh. so. But uh -huh. 
Uh, yeah, because he's been busy working. That's yeah, such lots a wonderful of times. problem to have. <laughs> yeah. Can't go to the award ceremonies <laughs> because you're working. And we get that because yeah. the actors do the same thing. Right, right. Yeah. They're not always able to yeah. be where they need to be because they're doing what they're supposed to be doing, yeah. prepa and providing yeah. us with entertainment. Yeah, that's it. And uh, yeah, and loving it, you know. Mm -hmm. And, and uh, uh, I know a couple of times I've talked to Greg and, you know, it's like I can't make it. But he actually let me do a video one time, send it. And that was, that was actually fun. A friend and I... Uh, we got together and we did a little video and and that was that was great yeah that was, a, that was awesome but um, if people want to connect with you do you have any availability through social media uh, do you have a website that people can check out i do yeah it's a www.com i mean i'm sorry www.depimpersonator.com and there's also ronnie rodriguez.com so and uh, i'm on facebook you can find me just look jack sparrow double uh -huh, uh -huh. <laughs> i'm there so Thank you so much for taking time out of your crazy schedule. I know we've been, we've had the honor of having you on campus in past years and we've worked really hard to get you back. And thank you for making it work in your schedule to be here this year and also agree to do the interview. Uh, what our viewers don't know is anytime we're asking you to do extra, 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 that's you being gracious with your time. And we so appreciate that. Yeah. And um, I look forward to others being able to learn more about your characters, your talent, okay. and following <laughs> your profession. Oh, good. Well, thank you for having me, Sharinda. It's, uh, yeah, it's, uh, um, it's been really amazing. Thank you. And I'm, You're very welcome. Yeah, just pleased I could be here. And next time, Jules has to come along. Yeah, I'll, I'll drag her along next time, I promise. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, Thank yeah. you so much for tuning in to today's special episode of the University of Finley Art and Culture Show. Until we see each other again, be well. <laughs>